it wasn't a red carpet affair, as movie celebrities including Funke Akindele, Fred Amata, sent to be Eddie Uboma and many others, converge on the Lagos office of the National Film and Video Census Board to inspect seized unauthorized works in the market. In recent weeks, the board had raided a notorious wing of the popular labor market in Lagos, where intellectual property are recreated without proper and due authorization. In five days, the tax force was able to remove the Alaba International Market Film and Video Works not classified and not approved for distribution in Nigeria from the premises not licensed being operated by persons not licensed to carry out the film and video business in Nigeria. Copies include some recent big budget cinema flicks such as The Wedding Party, Jennifer's Diary, Wives on Strike, A Trip to Jamaica and many others. Paris has been eating deep, you know, into our content. We work so hard around the clock. At the end of the day, the products are being pirated. It's sad, you know. We don't even cover the money of production. Um, it's it's crazy. Uh, I see Jennifer's diary out there on the streets. Even the original copies we we, we we churned out for people to buy, they're not buying them because they're buying pirated copies. According to the newly amended National Film and Video Census Board Act, signed into law by Vice President Yemi Ushimbajo in March 2017, convicted publishers of unauthorized works are liable to a maximum sentences of up to three years with an option of fine of about 500,000 naira. The legislation against pirates is not fair. That is why most people are not discouraged in engaging in the act. But we are also making some moves to ensure that the law against pirates is amended to give them a stiffer penalty. The federal government recently declared tax relief for investors in the creative sector to help speed up growth in the industry. Beyond this, stakeholders believe protecting intellectual property is equally important in making the industry attractive to prospective investors.